Hi, my name is Bill McPhee. I'm the CEO of Magpie Media Inc., your partner in mental wellness. Today, uh, we're going to take a question for Angelina. Uh, Angelina yesterday asked about uh, voices and suicide. So we covered uh, voices in yesterday's uh, uh, video blog. But today, I want to talk about um, suicide. Angela asks, is uh, suicide ever the answer? And the absolute question is, suicide is never the answer. Uh, with schizophrenia, 50% of people who have this illness will at one point in their life try to take their own life. And actually 10% succeed if you call that a success. However, I was one of those as well. I had a suicide attempt and uh, actually I was in danger. I had my life in danger more than once. But I want to tell you, for example, when I was walking down uh, a four-lane highway, number three highway, and uh, I was walking toward traffic with uh, traffic uh, coming, trucks coming, cars coming, being swerved away, and uh, I thought that I was I needed to prove myself to God. And so basically after being on the highway for a few minutes and not getting hit, I, I went off the highway. But the point is at that point there, um, I didn't want to die at that point. It was just my sick mind who brought me into the situation that took that would have took my life. And you say, well, why is that important? Well, that's important to realize because people uh, who have parents who have lost uh, sons or daughters or family members uh, regarding suicide can say, well, boy, maybe that person really didn't want to commit suicide. It was just their sick mind that brought them into the situation that would have took their life. And that was my case. I would, my sick mind brought me out onto the highway where actually if my life would have been taken, uh, it would have been probably um, an accident because I didn't want to die. But my sickness brought me into that situation that would have took my life. However, later on in the... Uh, in my battle with uh, mental illness, I had a suicide attempt, a deliberate suicide attempt, because I was so depressed. I uh, basically took, uh, I, I overdosed on my uh, sleeping medication, and I had to go, I was rushed to the hospital, my stomach pumped, and the next thing I remember is waking up in the psych ward again. However, I want to talk about suicide is, is never the answer. However, when we are very depressed, uh, suicide is a real thing. The symptoms that come along with suicide, basically with, with suicidal thoughts, are the fact we think that our situation is hopeless. We have such a poor self-esteem and uh, a, a feeling about ourselves, no confidence, and we feel that suicide is the only answer. We feel that we're hopeless, that uh, there's just no way out, and that's the last that's the last response is to not exist, to just not exist. But I got to tell you that there's always a way. And that's something that we don't understand when we're in, when we're in a depression is that there is always a way. Today as an entrepreneur, I know that there is always a way. And, uh, but when we're, when we're dealing with depression, we don't know that. So I think that some of the tips are talk to people. Uh, if you have suicidal ideation, um, talk to people and just uh, get it out and remember depression it will go away depression is treatable and depression will go away even if it's uh, not uh, uh, treated eventually depression will go away but until then we need to have uh, uh, a protection or we just have to say to ourselves I'm not going to think about suicide or do that one of the things, a practical tip of how that can help, if you have a suicidal loved one, make a contract one. Literally, make a contract and have them sign their name and write a letter and, and put it in that with you and your support that they will not attempt a suicide attempt. And that's one practical way of putting our mind at ease. But I just want to encourage you again. I know that depression is a terrible thing and that we have that hopelessness and that terrible feeling of depression, of worthlessness, but it will get better, and there is always a way. Thank you. If you have a question for me, just send uh, your question to bmcphee at magpiemags.com. Thank you.